Uh, good afternoon, dear student. Welcome back. Today we are going to discuss addition and subtraction of algebraic expression. Is that clear? Already we discussed basic concept of addition and subtraction of algebraic expression. Okay. Today we are going to learn more question so that it will be helpful for you. Now I have written here one question. Please check here. Eight. 5x square plus 3xy plus 4y square this is one term and this is another term is that clear now you have to add these two term already we discussed for addition and subtraction we need like terms so 5x square solution 5x square plus 3xy plus 4y square plus 2x square minus xy minus 3y square in question there is 8 it is given here so there must be plus sign is equals to you can write 5x square plus 3xy plus 4y square plus plus into plus plus 2x square minus plus into minus minus xy plus into minus minus 3y square is that clear now you have to arrange the like term here 5x square now we have to arrange that like term in such a way that is square term that is x square term x square term you have to keep together xy term xy term you have to keep to get, uh, together and y square term you have to keep together is that clear 5x square plus 2x square this term is square this is this plus 4y square minus 3y square and another term plus 3xy minus xy now please count the term 1 2 3 4 5 6 1 2 3 4 5 6 is that clear there is no mistake now already we discuss your x square x square both are like term so already we discuss you have to add only coefficient 5 plus 2 7 x square plus 4 minus 3 1 so if there is 1 then no need to write 1 because there is y square y square in front of y square there is 1 plus 3 minus 1 2 x y this is the answer is that clear understood this understood okay now i'll write another question this is a please check here 8 x square plus y square and 3 x square plus 4 y square solution x square plus y square plus 3x square plus 4y square now again same process x square plus y square plus 3x square plus plus into plus plus 4y square again we have to arrange the term like term we have to arrange that means x square plus you have to arrange term x square and 3x square 3x square plus y square plus 4y square again for confirmation you can count the term 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 okay now if there is no number in front of coefficient that is there will be 1 then 1 plus 3 4 4x square plus 5 y square this is the answer for this question is that clear this understood again uh, I'll, I'll do revision x square plus y square and 3x square plus plus 4y square we have to add over here then x square plus y square plus because 
uh, addition addition symbol we are writing here 3x square plus 4y square another term now please arrange the like term and do addition understood is that clear i'll write more question for you now more c 2a cube minus 4b cube and 6a cube plus 3b cube number d 3 square minus 4ab plus plus 2b square and 4a square minus 3ab plus 4b square now i am leaving these two question for you as home assignment please do this is that clear so this is very simple now a cube 2 a cube minus 4 b cube and 6 a cube plus 3 b cube you have to add like term and 3 a square minus 4 a b plus 2 b square and 4 a square minus 3 a b plus 4 b square i am leaving these two question for you as home assignment is that clear understood now subtraction subtract number 2 a 2x minus 4 from 5x plus 3 solution now 2x minus 4 from 5x plus 3 now we have to subtract 2x minus 4 from 5x plus 3 that means we are, we are going to subtract here 2x minus 4 from 5x plus 3 so first we have to write 5x plus 3 minus 2x minus 4 is that clear because we are going to subtract over here so 5x plus 3 minus 2x minus 4 now we are subtracting 2x minus 4 from 5x plus 3 so is equals to 5x plus 3 minus into plus minus 2x minus into minus plus so i think you know this operation minus into minus equals to plus plus into minus equals to minus minus into plus equals to minus plus into plus is equals to plus these are the four operation we are using over here is that clear these are very very important so again you have to arrange the like term let's check here 5x and 2x 5x minus 2x plus 3 plus 4 now these are the like term 5x minus 2x it will be 3x plus 7 so we are uh, we are subtracting 2x minus 4 from 5x plus 3 so our solution is 5x uh, sorry 3x plus 7 understood this is that clear now I am writing another question please check here 2x square minus 3y square 2x square minus 3y square from 9x square plus 12y square now solution please here we are subtracting 2x square minus 3y square from 9x square plus 12y square we are subtracting 2x square minus 3y square from 9x square plus 12y square like uh, like previous question 9x square plus 12y square minus why are we, why we are writing here minus because we are doing subtraction over here 2x square minus 3y 
square. Is that clear? E is equals to 9x square plus 12y square minus into plus minus 2x square minus into minus plus 3y square. Understood this? Simply we are opening the bracket. Now, again we, uh, we have to arrange the like term 9x square minus 2x square plus 12y square plus 3y square. So, this is also like term please here x square x square that is 9 minus 2 7 7 x square plus y square y square here like term 12 plus 3 15 15 y square you have to arrange the like term first and simply you have to add the coefficient coefficient of like term is that clear understood now i'll add more question number c 5x plus 2y from 3x minus 4y number d 4 minus 3y square plus 3. Now, I am leaving this uh, these two question as home assignment for you. Is that clear? This is very simple. You have to uh, subtract this from this. Okay. Now, another question I am writing here. What should be added? What should be added to 4x minus 5 to get 7x plus 2. Please check question here. What should be added to 4x minus 5 to get 7x plus 2? Which number you have to add? Which algebraic term we have to add to this term? So, we will get 7x plus 2. Is that clear? This is our question. Which term or which number we have to add with 4x minus 5 to get 7x plus 2? Is that clear? This is the question. Now, solution please check here. Let you can assume any constant number. Let A should be added, should be added, added to 4x minus 5 to get 7x plus 2. Therefore, you can write, we are adding A with 4x minus 5. Therefore, A plus 4x minus 5, it will be equals to 7x plus 7x plus 2. We are adding a with 4x minus 5 to get 7x plus 2. Are you getting me this? So, a plus 4x minus 5 is equals to 7x plus 2. Now, or you can write a equals to 7x plus 2. If you take this plus term to right hand side, then it will be minus, minus 4x. If there is plus, then minus, then if there is minus, then it will be plus. So, again, you can arrange the like term 7x minus 4x, that is plus 2 plus 5. That means 7 minus 4, it will be like term, that is 3x plus 7. Therefore, 3x plus 7, 3x plus 7 should be added, should be added, added to 4x minus 5 to get 7x plus 2. So, we have to add the algebraic term 
or algebraic expression 3x plus 7 to get uh, with 4x minus 5 to get 7x plus 2. Is that clear? Now, yeah, you can check your answer also. Please check here. We got the value 3x plus 7. We are adding with 3x plus 7 plus 4x minus 5. So, 3x plus 7 plus 4x minus 5. So, again you can arrange the like term 3x plus 4x plus 7 minus 5. So, 3 plus 4, 7x plus 2. So, our answer is correct. Therefore, 3x plus 7 should be added to 4x minus 5 to get 7x plus 2. Is that clear? Understood this? Okay. Now, similar type of question I will give you as home assignment. Please check here. What should be added to 3a plus 2b to get 6 uh, to get to get 6a minus 5b? This is your home assignment. Exactly same type. What should be added to 3a plus 2b to get 6a minus 5b? Is that clear? What should be what should be subtracted? What should be subtracted from six x minus two y six x minus two y six x minus two y plus one? to get 2x plus 3y minus 4. Now, please check your solution. What would uh, what should be subtracted from 6x minus 2y plus 1 to get 2x plus 3y minus 4? Here also, you can write here let same process let a should be now we are subtracting here so let a should be subtracted subtracted from here check question what should be subtracted from that means we have to subtract from this term 6x minus 2y plus 1. We have to subtract from 6x minus 2y plus 1. So, let a should be subtracted from 6x minus 2y plus 1 to get to get 2x plus 3y minus 4. 2x plus 3y 2x plus 3y minus 4. Is that clear? Let a should be sub, uh, subtracted from, we have to subtract e from this. That means, 6x minus 6x minus 2y plus 1 minus a. We are subtracting a from this term to get 2x plus 2x plus 3y minus 4. Understood this? Is that clear? What should be subtracted from this to get 2x plus 3y minus 4? That means, we are subtracting a from this term 6x minus 2y plus 1. We are subtracting a from this term. So, 6 or you can write 6x minus 2y plus 1 you can take all this term to left hand side here is because our intention is to find the value of a over here we are assuming a that a should be subtracted from 6x minus 2y plus 1 to get 2x plus 3y minus 4 so our intention is to here to find the value of a are you getting me so here plus 2x so if you take here then it will be minus 2x then if you take this plus 3y to left hand side, then it will be minus 3y. 
minus 4 then it will be plus 4 equals to a or you can write you can arrange the like term please see here 6x minus 2x minus 2y minus 3y plus 1 plus 4 equals to a or you can write 6x minus 2x it will be these are like term See here xx minus minus 5y plus 5 equals to a or you can write a equals to 4x minus 5y plus 5 therefore we are getting the value of a so therefore 4x minus 5y plus 5 should be subtracted from 6x minus 2y plus 1 to get 2x plus 3y minus 4 is that clear understood this is the solution are you getting me or not okay now I will write another question. Another type of question I am writing. Please here question. If x equals to p plus 3 and y equals to q minus p, then so that then so that x plus y equals to q plus 3 is that clear this is our question now please see a solution here x equals to p plus 3 and q equals to q minus p and we have to prove here x plus y equals to q plus 3 we have to prove so x plus x plus y equals to q plus 3 we have to prove here here you can write given solution here given x equals to p plus 3 is that clear then y equals to q minus p now please check here we have to prove here x plus y equals to q plus 3 so you can write here left hand side this is left hand side left hand side it is given here x plus y equals to q plus 3 we have to prove this so x plus y so the value of x you can replace here p plus 3 plus the value of y is q minus p is that clear now your one p is positive and another p is negative so you can cancel this term is that clear so 3 plus q it will, uh, it will be or you can write q plus 3 is equals to right hand side so here left hand side it was x plus y so we got right hand side q plus 3 are you getting me simply we are substituting the value of or we are replacing the value of or we are putting the value of x and y in this condition is that clear understood now let me write another question if x equals to a plus 2 x equal to a plus 2 and y equals to b minus a then so that then so that x plus y equals to b plus 2 and another question and another question question number 2 this is question number 3 if x equals to 2p minus q and y equals to p plus q then so that then so that 
x minus y is equals to p minus 2 q ok these two questions are also i am leaving you for as home assignment ok thank you very much